This is this is fairly uh, calm, luckily. David Nettle, the corpse's face is bloated from being so long in the water. The stench from its toothless mouth is so foul that your eyes begin to water. The hand clenching a sinister-looking spear is covered with scabs. Suddenly, you feel faint, as if cold. Wet hand, as if a cold, wet hand is placed heavy on top of your head. Wet hair sticks to your skin and tickles of icy cold water run down your face and shirt. A hoarse whisper rises inside your head. There you are. So it was you who sent me these nightmares. Gurgling, deep-chested laughter pierces your skull, clouding your vision and flooding your ears. All else become muffled, as if you're trapped underwater. You shake your head to cast off the apparition. Okay, what do you want? You see a vision of a man wearing an antlered helm. You hear a muffled groan, and the helm drops to the ground with a large thud. Your hands are covered with hot blood. Too much blood. Death to the Stag Lord. Can't you kill the Stag Lord? You see the Stag Lord and his cutthroats trying to build a new bridge here, then running madly away from the rotting monster. The Stag Lord has avoided this place ever since, and he can't go away from it. Um, very well, I shall meet your vengeance upon the Stag Lord. The drowned man who has been sitting motionless nods his head. Come later, take the spear. All right, David, David Nettle. Oh, did you get as far as the second stash? Was that what you meant? Oh, God dang it, it's locked. 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 What is the uh, difficulty? 27. Perception and then Tubman plus six. Ah, that means I can't get it, right? Yeah, I need to wait. Uh, where is it? There. No, there. No. How do I set? There. Custom marker. I will guide us. I can't use. Why? What? Can't use my keyboard. All of a sudden. There. Okay. Weird. Everyone else remember the DC of all the locks in the first two chapters, don't they? <laughs> uh, not me, Lord Mungo, but yeah, okay. <laughs> DC 27. Yay, the sound died. That happens from time to time. But this is nice. Now we can get our house kineticist with us. L oh, listen there's. Well, since you dispatched the bandits with such skill, maybe you can help us with another problem. There's a feral swine living in the woods. Not a normal pig, we're talking about a vicious boar. As big as a bear and wicked as a devil. The locals call him Tuscara. Many hunters have lost life and limb to him. Beckel Benson found his lair and went to kill the beast, but came back with the one leg. He put a bounty on the boar's head, but it looks like there aren't any heroes around here bold enough to claim it. Maybe you will get rid of this monster. And Mary livens up. Hey, we're better than local wussies, right? Wanna bet I can chop his tusk, this tusk got a snout in a single swing? Come on, let's find out. Uh, all right, let's kill the thing. Amiri gives you a wide grin and slaps your shoulder. Right, that's the way I like it. Let's do it. Not now. 
Not now. I mean, I yeah, I could have scummed that save as well, but uh, the the luck. Just until you get it, but I'll wait. I'll wait. I think we're gonna. I'm. I'm need. I need to uh, exit to desktop to get the sound back. Do you auto unlock on a crit? No. So, in this case, I wouldn't be able to unless I buffed some way. Because there's no critting on skills, on skill checks. That's always... Uh, so, if you roll a 20, it's your plus. So, it's 26 at a maximum I could have rolled. And it was a 27. Yeah. But maybe I could have found a buff somewhere like a I bless bless gives two skill checks as well if I remember correctly just rebooting just rebooting not done still have some time oh and the spider lair is gonna be fun 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 Pathfinder, stop. stop. Wait. Oh. It's coming. Or you could have saved scum and we could have watched you try and achieve the impossible. <laughs> That's true. That's true. I mean, if you don't know that skill checks can't be critical hits, crit I don't know, it's c critical checks. Then you could have, you could definitely have safe scummed all day. All day long. Oh. Oh, it, oh, it, okay. It muted the game. That's why. That was weird. Cooking evil. Awesome. Awesome, Fenrir. Yeah, I would, I would love for that to be a thing. But I can see that with my schedule and the time to do things that I want to do... I want to get done. I just wouldn't have the time. Some days I, I don't even have the energy to do any work on builds or anything. That's that's how it is. And I need to I need to recognize that. Alright. Fully rested. Uh I think I didn't grab the quest from Swedlana. Good day. I hope you're feeling all right after that battle. I can't thank you enough for what you've done. I definitely don't want to waste your time, but if you have a moment, I have a request. What did you want to ask me? Swadlana lowers her head. This is a very personal request and maybe not important enough for your time. I'll completely understand if you say no. I'm lawful good, so I'll say yes. But the first time the Stag Lord thugs came here demanding money, they also took my wedding ring, just tore it off my hand. It's just a trinket, really, but it meant so much to me. I remember every moment of that day when Oleg came to me, that ring in hand, to ask if I'd marry him. I was standing in a fancy dress on the stairs of my father's home, fearing that I'd misheard something or that I'd say something stupid and everyone would laugh. Swedlana interrupts herself, shaking her head gently. If you happen to find my ring among the bandit's possessions, please bring it to me. It's easy to recognize. My name is engraved on the si inside of the band. Swedlana drops her eyes, lowering her voice. There is one more thing. Among the bandits, there's a dark-haired woman who wields dual axes. She's not bad in a fight. In fact, she can be extremely dangerous and cruel. But please, I beg you, show her mercy if you have the chance. I will be happy to help you, Swedlana. Swedlana nods. I'm so grateful for your help. 
Um, I have to go. Bye bye. Bye bye now. Bye bye. All right, let's see what we have of words. Uh, maybe I can actually. Uh, hold on. Yes. Can I use any of this? We have a medium armor. He has a light armor. He can use medium armor. If I'm not mistaken, without taking penalties or anything. At least right now. So that's six armor class. I think he has the banded mail. Yeah. Uh, and we have a light armor, but that's. Fine, a leather armor. This one is better. Yeah. Chain shirt. On the kineticist. Nothing on you. It's really late that you actually get some robes that you can use. A Miri. <clears throat> and a chain mail. Long sword. Masterwork? No. Plus one. First magic item. And the light shield for the heavy shield. I'm a class twenty one, that's that's decent. Oh, you can't you can't see. See I can move myself now, so I can show stuff like that. Yeah? That's pretty cool. I'm a class twenty one. He will never be using tower shields. But that's fine. I can I can definitely live without that. The tower shield. What is this? Resist cold, shocking grasp. I mean, he has used magic device, so. Uh, vanish and mage armor. Healing potions, we don't need all those because I have the mod that adds them again. Remove blindness, we at least have one of those. And flasks. Uh, cubby. 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 And acid, acid flask. He's going to use Acid Flasks. Cool. We'll sell the rest. He has a Ring of Protection, but I think we'll, we'll live without just for now. Uh... The heavy shield plus one is very tempting. So is the full plate. Because that's two extra armor class. Yeah. Let's do it. Let's do it. I'm happy about it. 23. Nope, I can actually use that on him instead. She has one as well. I need to keep them a bit updated. Just a bit. Bucken puts his hand on his hips. Ha! Huh. Old Boggin knows a few tricks to impress these blood-sucking dummies. Enough hiding in the damn bushes, I say. Sh uh, can you help in any way? Boggin glances at you, suddenly interested. Well, since you're asking, there's a cave nearby. I used to pick berries in there, but the place has been overrun by spiders. The berries are red and look a lot like raspberries. Fangberries, I call them. 
I'd be grateful if you gathered a basket of them and brought them back. Just be quick if you do, they spoil quickly. Those spiders in the cave are me. Here, let me give you some alchemical fire. Crafted it myself. Burn those spiders to a crisp. I will teach... Uh, that will teach them for taking over my fangberry cave. I also need a bucket of moon radishes. They are rare and a mysterious plant. I don't know where to find them, but I know that copals gather them and value them highly. It's not a huge deal, really. I'd do it myself if I were younger. But if you're willing, I'll pay you. Three potions for the berries and purse full of coins for the radishes. Alright, I'll help. Let's go. I will guide us. Let's go find some stuff. And now we can bring you. And then we just need one more and we can bring Lord Mon uh, Lord Mungo as well. Hey Needly, good to see you. New story. Exactly. I think I think we're going to go for Thorn Fjord first. What is that? Bloodfire fever. Uh Bloodfire fever? What does that even do? I don't know. We'll see. I can't remember. Oh, he's fatigued. Ah. Oh, it makes him fatigue quicker. Maybe. Share your exploits, almighty Draco Blade. Unfortunately, he's not going to be as powerful as the Draco Blade we know from the Chaotic Evil, because something was definitely off with that one. I can only get this build to six attacks at the end, which is also really good, but definitely not, definitely not the same as... Oh, this is bad with the rain. But yeah, definitely not the same as 20 attacks. It's insane. Don't know what that is all about. Wolf Fiasti. Thank you. Thank you for the follow, buddy. Very nice to have you. I'm gonna rest until this... Uh... Until this storm is over, because... Minus 6 perception is really, really bad. Camouflage failed. But it's fine. But I still have the rain debuff? Really? Really? Game. Let's go out here and go back in. Cheating. Cheating game. There we go. Okay. Let us get his centipede out for one. He has two pets. And major armor on Draco. Oh, the troth stays. Nice. That is that and that is that. And we need to not burn too much here. Uh, let's see, we have this. This is the kineticist. That we love so much. And, oh. Demoralize is what we're going to be using, but not just yet. Not just yet. Later, later. We will use Demoralize a lot on him. It is going to be awesome. Wow, that is blue. Hello. 
Yeah, I had to come and say hello to a YouTuber thanks to you. Last three weeks I spent watching your Mordheim Warbands. You are probably one of the fewest YouTubers which are playing on deadly difficulty and have run from it. <laughs> I am I am insane like that. I am crazy. And you know it. That's uh I don't know why, but it, it, the game is just so much better on deadly difficulty. So thank you very much. Thank you, buddy, and thank you for the support. Thank you for watching my videos. That is that is always awesome to hear. The dark-haired bandit is kicking the ground irritably. When she sees you, she squares her shoulders and clenches her hand axes. Well, look who's here. She was there when we faced the bandits. Easy now. I'm not here to blanket the stolen lands with corpses. But where you have been and let's talk. I won't kill anyone who leaves the Stag Lord's service and is willing to find me, uh, help me find him. So, think about it. Is he really a leader you're ready to die for? Something in your words seems to have impressed Cressel. She frowns for a moment, then spits. Fine, I won't cut your throat. For now, at least. But I also won't kneel to some rest of upstart. Why would you try to make peace? Are you just unnaturally unnat kind? Or have you been listening to Svetlana? Uh, I need to go as good as possible, so neutral good is probably the best one. Is it so hard to believe I simply might not want unnecessary bloodshed? You know, life hasn't been good to me, Kressel replies sullen. Why should I trust you? Alright, here's my piece. The Staglord's been spending more time keeping the uh, an eye on the bottom of his glass than on what is going around him on around it. If he won't answer to insult from some rest of crook like Jamandi, then you're right. We chose the wrong leader. So go ahead. Whatever you're gonna do, I won't stop you. But I won't help you either. And here, give this to Swedlana. The bandit places a ring in your hand then leaves. Cool. So in the uh, Chaotic Evil Let's Play I did, we killed that bunch and took the ring instead. So already here, different Let's Play. And we didn't have to fight them. <laughs> Thank the gods. <laughs> Thank the gods. Thank you, Aori. Oh. You see a dark-haired man, about 45. Thro though the wrinkles on his face make him look 60 at first sight. He's currently a prisoner, judging from his tied hands. He slouches a bit, squinting short-sightedly at the light as he moves. His lips as though speaking to someone invisible. He jerks up his head as he notices you. Praise Aerostil! Someone finally chased off those scoundrels. Thank you, stranger. My name is Jod Karfkin. I'm a priest of Aerostil, from Gaul. Those bandits attacked me, and I was crossing the river. Said they wanted to make take me to their leader. Make me heal their wounds. Not a chance. The strength granted me by Aerostil is meant to help honest people, not robbers. How did you come to be in these lands, Jod? No, I'm... I'm... Release Jod. I'm just gonna release him. I picked lawful uh, evil before. Jod mutters a bit, rubbing his hands. Oh, these times. To be a surprise to meet an honest man as to see a manticore at a vegetable store. That would be weird. Thank you for your help. I've exhausted my supplies of prayers, but I'll gladly repay you in the future once I've restored my strength. Come to me if you ever need to be healed or blessed. I'm afraid an old fool like me won't be able to handle the mission given to me by Aerostil on my own. How can I search for the temple when the bandits around here won't let me take a single, single step? I'll head to Olex Leventon's trading post to rest and think on what to do next. Please, traveler, if you happen to discover the ruins of the Temple of Elk, come inform old John. My gratitude will know no bounds. Ah. Cool. I love it. Oh, dang. You are insane. Thank you. I take that as a praise. I don't want to play on higher than hard because my warband is dying so fast and you love it. <laughs> Good luck in the stream. I'm watching the die series right now. I hope you'll do more 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 time campaign. Maybe. Maybe. I've played... I've seriously turned 
800 hours of Mordheim content uh, out on YouTube. So there's there's plenty to watch, but there might be more going on later. But right now, I'm I'm knee deep in Pathfinder Kingmaker. I'm making builds for it. I'm having so much fun, and this is a an entirely new play. Let's play where we are lawful good and there's no kingdom building so it's all adventuring which i like i like i'm i'm gonna enjoy that i think all right let's get safe scum this one. No, oh, okay <laughs> actually made it it's only a 15. oh god i failed that i think it takes practice to do uh deadly missions in in more time but uh, once you get the ai you can you can do it you can definitely do it the bandits piled together belongings are piled together in messy heap search the belongings oh dang it i don't know what it actually does but i'll i'll get it anyway <laughs> Uh, we should move. I, I'm gonna, I'm gonna get it anyway because you can get the, Impossible. you can get the uh, wine, and I don't know if it gives him a debuff or whatever. But I like, I like the idea of <laughs> getting, getting the wine. Wine for the stag lord. Don't you dare steal it, fools! I'll make sure you rot. So. Lawful good, actually, lawful good would never, would never poison the wine. We would take the wine, as to not give him the pleasure of having the wine. So we're gonna, we're gonna grab it. Forwards. Instead. Man, uh, those artifacts, I would love to put together some of those in this Let's Play. Like, really go for getting all the necklace pieces, for instance. That would be nice. Serve. Oh god, what the heck? Oh, the trap triggered. How did the, how did the trap trigger even? How did it, how did it? I don't get it. Oh, there's another trap. Oh. Alright, let's see. Charlotte the Great. Miss. <laughs> Damn it! That's terrifying. Terrible. Terrible, guys. It's just a dog. Ooh. Well, he took a hit, but it's fine. It's time to act. Meow. I like that. All right. I'm gonna save again. I, I should reload that, but it's fine. Nope. <laughs> Did we get XP? No, you don't even get XP. Screw it. Screw it. I want the XP. From at least one of the traps. Thank you. It's 22 XP, guys. It's, it's like a lot when you need that many. Interesting. Ring of protection plus one. Thank you very much. It's nothing else. No. Oh, and a masterwork heavy flail. I don't actually use the heavy flails, though. Boop. All right, so do we carry on? I guess we carry on. Ah, uh, I don't know how hard are the buggers, bugger, buggers, <laughs> the buggers. I know the abandoned hut has wolves in it. 
Screw it. Let's go for the Fangberry Cave because that's good XP. And it's going to be hard. <laughs> Whoa, Endless Plains? Don't remember those either. Okay. Just going to rest. Uh, buckets have nasty skills early on. Okay. Yeah, I fought them at level... I think we were 13, 12 or something. You'll love the Endless Blade. Thanks. Uh, uh, at level 3. Okay. Level 3. We'll do it then. Uh, kitty. Rapid shot. Alright, we're ready. I mean, he could burn a bit. To get some increased damage. He doesn't get the bonus yet. That's not until later. Uh, yeah, it's fine. One of the Boggart maps will wreck you. Thanks! That's awesome. <laughs> I love they added new maps. Oh, hi! Young deer. And as a lawful good, I'm of course not gonna hurt the animals. Right? Unless they... If they attack us, we will. Hey, baby. Dag it. <laughs> I didn't get to finish. Did I? Okay. I said that. <laughs> uh, Alright, let's shoot this one. Dang it! Oh! Oh, he actually did cast shield. Okay, cool. As I told you to. Uh, shoot that one. Yeah, but we don't need food at this point, Vandalia. I'm not just aimlessly gonna kill animals just standing there. A <laughs> lawful good vegan? Yeah. <laughs> we have food here. Shala the Great. Nice. It's it's low damage at this level, okay? It's gonna get better. And that goes for everyone, I guess. Very nice. No, it did. No, no, Mordring. It's not gonna hurt when you don't hit. Mr. Topman. And, uh, kudo. Kudos. There. This should do it. Maybe. Yeah. You better shape up. There we go. Come on. Yeah. Punch it. Kick it. God dang it. Shoot it. Animal cruelty. 101. <laughs> Oh, I love having the kineticist though. I'm very, very happy that. Wow, five damage? Wow, you critted. You critted, Artbug. You son of a doodle. You surprise me ever more. Okay. So this part. Is this part is gonna be rough, I think. Me thinks. Together we stand. So does everyone have some sort of concoction to throw? You have one. You have one. You have acid one. Uh, you get one. And he doesn't need one. He, as a kineticist, you can hit. Why is he lower XP? That's weird. 
Okay. <laughs> Weaken is chaotic neutral. <laughs> oh, I see, I see. Their life ends here. All right, bring it, Spidey. Let's move the camera around so we can actually see. Charlemagne. No, Charla. Charla the Great. I love that name. That is a great name for what he needs to do. Ah, uh, do we do we do this? Man, I don't want to get debuffed here. Where are the spider swarms though? Our bug. This should do it. His, uh, the reach on the cantrips is not that good. Shield. It's even harder now? Dang it! Really? I thought they made it easier. Oh, because you have the secret room. You have the secret room. Where all the, the uh, swarms are in. Right, right, right. Um, keep shooting that one. Dang it! Yeah, his his base attack bonus is is really bad at this point. What do they have? I'm a class twenty. It's fine. Well, it should be fine. Oh, they are lined up really nicely though. But I don't want to waste that. Oh, nice hit. There comes the strength debuff. Oh, that one. Doesn't help if he misses all the time. Stop missing. Yeah, you have the different cave sections now. Two strength. Oh, great. That's just that's just awesome. That's just awesome. I'm thinking we can come back for the second part if we survive this. <laughs> Aim carefully. Come on. This should do it. I'm class 19, so on the touch. Strike. I'm I'm missing everything right now. Strike as one. Can't hit Jack. Thank you. That's at least one. Ow. Our bug got hit. I need to mobility on out of there. Nope. At least there's no swarms here. That would have been insanely not cool. Yeah, because you had to deal with the swarms. No matter what, you were always faced with the swarms. Oh, the, the to hit is just terrible, guys. It is insane. Let's try this way. And he is hitting nothing. No. This happen? I thought he could reach. Forgive me for this failure. All right. Reload. Reload time! Let's not waste that. Ready for anything. Alright, let's try again. We can do this. I mean, look at all the missed attacks we had. 
That was just really unlucky. Oh, and you blocked your friends. Perfect. And I mean, the plus two AC didn't really do much. Very nice. Let's kill that one first. Okay. I, I guess Tupman was like, hey, that's what we're doing. <laughs> Perfect. Thank you, buddy. Yeah, Iron Man in this... You can do Iron Man, but I don't think... Unless you play on story, you wouldn't survive long. You definitely wouldn't survive very long. Uh, let's... Jolt! Uh, not so much hurt as you might think yourself. This Shala. Do it. Nope. We shall overcome. Pa <laughs> oh, all you the missings. Won. And then you have the strength debuffs, which makes it even harder to hit afterwards. Risk. Uh, I do have less of restoration, but... It gives him back three strength, at least. Come on, crit 14. Okay, then it didn't really matter that much. Yeah, where's your wall of fire now? Not here yet. Oh, God. Don't hold back. Yeah, I, I wish I could do unfair. But I can't even see that happening. I've tried a couple of times. And it just seems... Do it. Crazy. But one of the things that you need to... Keep in mind is that... You turn off the party shared XP. In in those... Le in those uh, playthroughs. So that you get all the full XP. On one person. So you level up really quickly. Once you get past the first couple of... Uh, encounters. And that's why it's possible. Otherwise, I mean, you couldn't you couldn't do I would like to see unfair with a full party. I've never seen anyone do that. I don't think I don't think that's going to be possible. Why even shoot? Could this happen? I think we're dead. Ow. Oh man. I miss I miss my wall of fire. I do. Yeah. Challenge runs runs instead. Yeah. Let's try this. Try this for size. Hey, Strato Online. Currently during TB Unfair with a five party. Five man party? Dude, that is awesome. Only sharing with, with that, those five, right? But still, that's impressive, dude. I'm impressed. I mean, I'm having a hard time on hard with this party. I think I've. I've done an okay job, you know, <laughs> but, oh man, making the builds and all.
Right. Punch. No. Yeah. Good punch. 12 damage. Yeah. I, I agree, Oddbug. On hard, you need, really need to know the game mechanics. You can't just go in completely blind without a build or something. Ow! Bye bye. Alright, at least that that's one. Uh stunning. Dang it. Saved. A streamer called Vergilia or something who plays on unfair with the whole party. That's insane, guys. That's insane. I don't know. It, it gotta be. It gotta be a lot of reloading, <laughs> like a lot, to get all of this to line up. You know. This will hurt. And it, knowing exactly where you need to go to get the XP and reloading to get all the traps and all that stuff. This should do it. Maybe. Because hard is hard <laughs> in itself. <laughs> Couldn't imagine doing unfair. Ooh, nice. Very nice. Tubman is killing it. Tubman is killing it. Yeah, maybe one day. I mean, I played on hard to begin with and I couldn't I couldn't make it work and now I'm playing on hard and making it work if only they would hit right see we can deal 17 damage in one hit here so we just we just need the hits guys not the misses nope not the misses that's risky yeah that's risky Come on. Tupman is my top damage dealer at this point. Yeah, we don't have Bless. We don't actually have any cleric spells at this point. Oh. We get we're getting closer. That's the sweet hit. That's the sweet hit. They're animals. They're not evil. They're just defending their cave thing. Learn from my mistake. Okay. Time to use these. Nope. Strike. Cause I miss a calculated risk. Yes. Oh. Oh, that was hurtful. <laughs> Whew. Really good. Ah. I am never wrong. Alright, let's remove that. I mean four. Thank you, Strato. Strato. Thank you very much. Thank you, guys. I shall not oh, we are just really we low on everything here. Let us not uh, we do have... Like, we have restoration, but we need... We need to rest to use it. So, I'm just gonna go... I'm just gonna go outside for a moment. Forwards. And rest. But that was fun. No, we might get attacked. Nope. Okay. I will see this through. 
My skills are absolute. A bit of healing. And then potions for the rest. We have a good deal of Focus potions. On the goal. Should be fine. There we go. Alright, nice. Not a fan of pausing mechanics in games. It breaks my immersion. Turn-based at least re resembles good old pen and paper. Exactly. Ex I, I could not have said it any better, Mordring. Without a doubt. That's exactly how I feel. I, I mean, I was pausing all the freaking time anyway. Because otherwise I didn't know what, what was going on in the game. I literally had no idea. So I'm I'm very happy with the turn-based option. Our path leads on. God, we have more. There's more of these things. At least we can sort of... Uh, Tie them in here, I will like that. Falter. We see one. Hello. Hey, I'm a drone. It's a mod called uh, Fast Travel. So you can increase the game speed on exploration. I have 200% on the global map, 200%. But in battle, I have the normal speed. Just remember that buffs will reduce faster as well when moving around with the increased speed. Okay, maybe maybe not because they're not, they're not coming back here. Quality of life, exactly. I use I use a lot of quality of life stuff, but since I've completed the game once, I felt I needed a change as well. So I've added some class mods. And I only have, uh, ow, I only have uh, characters that are mercenaries in my party. I should have burned a bit. I should have burned a bit. Jeez, stop. I should have buffed. I didn't buff. Okay, great. I'm an idiot. Another four, by the way. Another freaking four. Ooh. All right, Tupman, get going. Okay, okay, that's a reload. That's a. I I need I need to buff before going in there. I, I maybe I should even rest even more. I don't know, but we'll see. Everyone counts on me. I am prepared. Maybe I can manage. Yes. We still have the shield. And we need to pop. I will see this and enlarge. This should do it. Uh, let us try this. Nope. Uh, this, yeah, this is the turn-based mod. Basically turns the game into what it is in the paper, pen and paper version. Because pen and paper is turn-based. So it makes sense. At least to me. To play like this. Don't really want to leave these guys open to attacks, so I'm just gonna charge there. Good hit. Uh, no, I'm a drone. It's uh, it's a mod you need to download. If you use uh, exclamation mark PFK mods, you can see a list of the mods I've covered on my YouTube channel, including the turn-based mod and how to install mods in Pathfinder Kingmaker. Man, everything is going to be so much better at level 3, though. 
I am looking forward to that. Come on. <laughs> the two hit is so bad. Alright, punch it. Well done. Hang in there, Draco Blade. Hang in there, buddy. Please hit. I need I need hits. Guys, we need hits. Okay. Shala? Shala la 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 didn't hit. Yes. Another seven. I'm a solid plan. Not happy about that. Shoot it. I don't know. No. Ah This will hurt. Ooh, nice. Uh, shall I kill it? Oh, he did. He done diddly do it. Come on. No. Oh. Man, turn base just makes it so much more intense. Usually, like when when it was uh, real time, I was just like, oh, oh, what happened? Okay, game over. Or we won. But I, do, I never knew who was actually doing what. Yes! Punch! Kick! Dude, you need to hit. Level 3 and 5. Yeah, 3 and 5. I totally agree. Man, I love Topman. No! Why? Why shoot? Why, you dumb doodle? Okay, at least he didn't die-die. Die die. Okay. Draco Blades gets a charge with a stunning fist. So hopefully. He did save, but we did hit him for 14. And Topman. Yes! Oh, thank you. Thank you. Uh, can I check somewhere what builds you're playing? Strato, yes you can, buddy. Um, for now, I haven't done the videos yet, but as you are a uh, subscriber, because I think you got a gift sub before Christmas, right? When you're a subscriber, you can check my builds out when I've written the... Um, I have a script, so I can show you here. Uh, let me see... Display capture there. So I am working on the builds. And while I'm working on them, I put them in this uh, text form. And this is what I'm going to put in the video. But you guys as subscribers have access to these text forms. So you can actually find all the builds that I'm, I'm working on in the Discord channel. I'm gonna put the Kineticist build up and I'm gonna put my Ranger build up that I'm so I'm still contemplating what to do with him, but I think I have it down. And I'm I'm gonna keep working on these as uh, as time goes. Thanks, thanks Strato. It's like a, a child to me because I, I really love just nerding down into, into these builds, but I wanna make sure that I get things right, so they do take a, a bit to do, but I have I have a rough idea of what to do with all these characters. <sighs> well, that went better than before. Hello, Feng... Barry's. Did he take damage? <laughs> maybe, maybe heal. The Fangberry. Oh God, they actually hurt. Done. Thank you. Oh wait, there's more. There's more. Mm -hmm. So when you join, um, you just need uh, the Discord channel. If you join the Discord channel, you need to tie your Twitch channel, uh, Twitch, 
account to Discord to get access to the Twitch sub VIP thing. It, oh, is this is this the place? I need to check. I need to check. I saved. I saved. Oh yeah, this is the spider swarms. Okay. How many are there? Just the one? Can't reach. Should not have gone there. Okay. Uh, shoot. Shoot. Oh, just one here and three in the next room. Oh, God. Yeah, I, I... When I did this, it was in, like, early days. So, I never saw this piece of the game. Strike. Yeah, the pun has changed. As you can see, Streamlabs is now my bot. Unfortunately... Ow... Unfortunately, the uh, Bautismo crew chose to go into a paid plan, and I just don't have the moolah to pay every month for uh, their service, to be honest. If I was earning, like, steady income off my channels, that would be a different thing, but I'm not. <laughs> it's not steady at all. <laughs> Very much unsteady. Ooh! Very nice. <laughs> this is a clear abuse of my power. And I can only do it because I'm lurking. I actually have a lurk command now as well. Just... People like a lurk command, I guess. No! Oh! Stop missing! I feel, I feel we're hitting better. But that might just be confirmation biased. I don't know. Still missing. <laughs> A lot. Ow! Come on. And then, then I jinxed it. I totally jinxed it. Come on, Topman. Topman. Topman, you are the best. You are the man. I'm always ready. No, you're not. We have so on the goal. so little health left, but I need to carry on. And we need we need to see. I mean, who knows? Maybe we can do it. That is a welcome gift. Because he can actually use it. 